Hiya love! So in this video I'm going to be chatting about some cruelty free and vegan products. Hopefully it will enlighten you to uh, buying new products that are much better for you and for the environment. You got your brew ready? Right, let's get chatting then. brands and products are never tested on animals which means they're tested on us the people that are going to use the products which to me makes a lot more sense because they don't need to be tested on animals there are over 500 cruelty free brands in the UK alone and so my question is why aren't these products available to buy in the larger retailers like supermarkets and convenience stores a lot of uh, vegan and cruelty free products will be handcrafted and made with completely organic ingredients uh, more often than not they are sold by independent businesses of course their prices will be slightly higher because they have uh, a unique and ethical selling point which is their product a perfect example is Soli Soy, a cruelty free and vegan candle company. I'm going to show you the candle that I keep on my window ledge. It is this one right here, plum, rose and patchouli. I absolutely love it. These have been handmade. They smell incredible. And what I love about it is that you're not just paying for a cruelty free and vegan product, but you're paying for something that has been made with love and care. They're such a good brand. I'm going to put the link to their website below so you can check them out. Now, as I said before, some of these products are made with organic and natural ingredients, which can mean that they are slightly more expensive. Of course, whenever you go into Tesco and you're looking to buy some shower gel, you'll see, I don't know, a Dove shower gel that's a pound it's been reduced and naturally you'll want to buy that because it's cheap we buy these products because it is convenient to us the larger retailers have put them on sale because they know that people will buy them and that they will make a profit from them and essentially they want to make a profit from the produce and products that they sell honestly i don't think that should be their driving motive and here's why the number one vegan shower brand in the uk is called original source they have 100 percent natural fragrances and they're a completely cruelty free brand now no matter what superstore or shop you go in to buy your shower gel i can guarantee you will see natural source and it is usually the mint one especially if it's like a co-op local or uh, I don't know, a Tesco Express or something like that. The reason the big retailers sell it is because there is a demand for it. People want to buy this product. Not only that, but this product is often reduced or on offer, which makes it even more appealing. I bought a natural source shower gel for a quid, a pound in Tesco. What's not to love? Even when it's not on offer, it is still cheap. There are a lot of cruelty-free products like original source that are cheap to buy but the thing is they're not made as accessible to people as the bigger brands that aren't cruelty free about three and a half to four years ago i started to question the products that i was buying and i do think that this was largely to do with my friends at the time who some of which had turned vegan and they had started to introduce me to products that were cruelty free and of course vegan and when I became aware of of them I suddenly went it's unnecessary for us to test on animals when we're you know when we're producing these products that we use it doesn't make any sense and so my first port of call was actually makeup because I use it quite frequently and I use it for acting so I thought well I might as well start there I have a fairly good idea of what cruelty free makeup brands work for me uh, and so what I wanted to do was sort of give you a quick list of those so you can maybe check them out yourself so my absolute number one favorite is NYX Cosmetics NYX for me it is affordable it is available in boots in superdrug and online it's very easy to get um 
one thing that I wish is that the supermarket sold it as well because it is on the cheaper end of the cruelty free makeup um brands and I do think that they could make something from it um but yeah I absolutely love NYX and some of my favorite eyeshadow palettes are from there so yeah that's number one number two is Smashbox a little bit more expensive than NYX but I found that in terms of um, the acting work that I do, it's very long lasting makeup and it works so, so well for anything that I do on stage. That's available at Boots and online as well. Really good, really, really good. I would 100% recommend. Last but no means least is The Body Shop. Now, all of their products are completely cruelty free and as far as I know, majority are vegan as well which is even better their makeup is brilliant really it's all natural personally i don't use like their foundations and things like that but i like their eyeshadows and i really like their lipsticks as well so i would definitely recommend those it's also worth me mentioning i think that superdrug their home brand is completely cruelty free and that isn't just makeup, that's across the board, that's everything. They are making cruelty-free and vegan products accessible to people at low prices. And that, for me, is like win-win, really. I think once I started to change my makeup, I started to look at other products that I used on a regular basis, like what my skincare routine was. Uh, my shower gels, my shampoos, my conditioners, my makeup remover, things like that. I wanted to find products that were natural, that were cruelty free, that were vegan, um, that were all round ethically better. I actually think that in using these products, I improved, uh, I improved my skin massively. Let alone, you know, how my hair was, like the shine, the moisture that was in it. There were so many benefits to me using these products. There are products that you use every day that you could find an alternative for, which is cruelty-free or vegan. Some of these might be antibacterial spray, it could be hand wash, it could be washing detergent for your clothes. Now, in our house, we use a brand called eCover, and we started using it probably about a year ago and they create household cleaning products. It is sold online and it's also sold at Tesco, Sainsbury's, Waitrose, Ocado, eCover Direct, Homebase, I think, have I missed anyone out? Morrison's and Amazon as well. So it's sold at so many of the larger retailers. Their products are cruelty free and vegan and they have a section of products as well that are UK allergy approved which means that they have no fragrances, they have no enzymes and they have no colourings. They work with plant based ingredients, biodegradable packaging and they are doing an incredible job of using less palm oil in their products which is a huge huge deal. They're naturally derived active ingredients that essentially mean you use less energy less water and fewer materials to well to effectively clean your house <laughs> here is one of their zero products which is the allergy uk tested product as you can see uh it's well this is a biodegradable bottle which is amazing um it's got no colors in it no fragrances nothing great for sensitive skin now any cruelty free or vegan product may have this little cruelty free bunny on it and for anyone who is beginning to look for cruelty free and vegan products that little leaping bunny symbol is a great thing to look for i'll be making a series of videos with more specific information on certain products as well as a video on eco-friendly products that will result in less waste I hope you enjoyed this video and if you really enjoyed it and would like to see more please subscribe just below i will put any useful links that i think might help below as well so you can check out more cruelty free and vegan products but in the meantime stay safe and speak to you soon peace out